Hello everyone, and welcome back. Today, we're diving deep into the world of electric bicycles, specifically focusing on their safety. Are electric bicycles as safe as they're marketed to be? Let's find out. E-bikes have gained immense popularity due to their cost-effectiveness, eco-friendliness, and convenience. But as more and more people adopt this technology, concerns about safety, particularly concerning lithium-ion batteries, have arisen. By 2023, approximately 70 different safety standards related to electric bicycles have been published, 18 of which are national standards. But incidents involving e-bike fires still make headlines. Why the discrepancy? Well, many of these standards focus on the e-bike as a whole but leave out crucial details about battery safety. There are several factors that contribute to e-bike fires. Poorly manufactured batteries, using unauthorized chargers, and physical damage to the battery are among the top culprits. Always make sure you are using a charger provided by the manufacturer and keep an eye on your battery's condition. Nut. Some safety guidelines have their flaws. For example, the requirement for e-bikes to have a pedal function is often seen as unnecessary, adding only to the manufacturing cost and weight. Dot. Experts call for an overhaul of existing safety standards, focusing on the specifics of lithium battery safety. More rigorous monitoring, consistent compliance across regions, and corporate responsibility are needed to make e-bikes safer for everyone. Dot. Before we wrap up, here are some quick tips for e-bike users. Educate yourself on battery specifications. Always use the manufacturer-provided charger. Regularly inspect your e-bike, especially the battery. Stick to basic cycling safety rules, like wearing a helmet and obeying traffic laws. To sum up, e-bikes offer many advantages but also come with their set of safety concerns. Being aware and educated can go a long way in ensuring your safety while enjoying these benefits. So, stay safe and stay informed. That's it for today's video. If you found this information useful, please hit the like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.